Brad Nessler joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreet. This is going to be very unpleasant cold weather for these boys to battle as we get ready for the Ohio State Buckeyes and the West Virginia Mountaineers. It's been a great football season so far, and it'll only get better as the bowl picture comes into focus here late in the season. And here come the Mountaineers. We have two good teams here, and I'll be honest with you, I really don't know what to expect in this game. Ohio State has a guy at wide receiver that everybody's talking about, and for good reason. He's the strength of this offense, an offense that can really spread the ball around. Lee, watch for him to come up big in this one. No doubt about it, Kirk. This way for you, Kirk. I'm going with Ohio State. game underway he sends it off Paul takes from the 10 missed tackle now let's see what kind of success this offense can have as they come out onto the field for the first time today on the field right now is a pretty good player at linebacker what do you think Kirby Pretty good is an understatement, Brad. This guy is a great player. His team is going to rely on him to shut down this solid rushing pack. This linebacker is going to have a lot on his hands today, Kirk. This team is very good on the ground. And if they let this running back get loose, then they're in for a long, long, long day. Ohio State has a pretty impressive offense this year, wouldn't you say, fellas? The numbers say it all, Brad. This team is one of the top ten offenses in the entire nation. Yep, they've been clicking on all cylinders this year. Let's see if they can continue to play well today. West Virginia has one of the top defenses in the nation. Have a look at the stats. I'll tell you what, this whole defense seems to be full of All-Americans. No doubt about it, these kids are the real deal, my friend. At the point, he's pushed out of bounds at the 38-yard line. Nice pickup on that run. Here's a perfect example of running the toss play. Good pitch, good catch, and blocking was good enough up front to spring this tailback to a monster game. First, First down, 10 to go on the 38-yard line. Paul, the lone back. Paul on the pitch to the right. He throws it to his quarterback. That's a great tackle. The 39-yard line, loss of a yard. We've got a second and 11. They'll line it up with four wide receivers. And the snap goes to the back. They'll get him for a loss. Kirk, they really had nothing going on that run. I'll tell you what, Brad, it's almost like he ran into a brick wall on that play. Third this defense 12. faces another oh, third down. Yard. The Buckeye come out in the ace formation. He's looking to pass. He steps up under pressure. Johnson comes away with a sack. 
And that's his fifth sack of the year. He's really been playing very well, guys. The numbers say it all, Brad. He plays hard on every play, and he's been a menace to every quarterback he's played against. Yeah, as an offensive coordinator, you really have to factor this guy into your game plan. He is always around to mess things up. Fourth and long. It's fourth down, and the punt team lines up. to return. He gets it away, and it's a skyrocket. Signals for a fair catch. This is a pretty good place for them to start their first drive. Yeah, this is a great opportunity early on in the game to get some points on the board, Coach. They'll go to work at the 10-yard line. The Buckeyes will bring in their dive package. First and 10. Britton drops back. He unloads it. Got his man on the run. Brought down at the 26-yard line. The defense looked a little lost on that one, Kirk. Yeah, they did, Brad. Nice recognition here by the quarterback to see that confusion and then take advantage of it. From their own 26-yard line, it's first down. Big yeah. dog, big dog. Ah. Britton. Hands off on the delay. He's tackled at the 28-yard line. Watson comes away with two yards on the carry. Second it's second down and eight to go. Ball on their own 28. West Virginia comes out in the shotgun. Britton with a bullet. And that one's well, fallen incomplete. Too far for the wide end. From their own 28-yard line. Third and eight. Britton lines up in the shotgun. Britton, back to pass. Comes across the middle. The defender had it and then dropped it. They might have had a shot at a first there. Yeah, but the defense was waiting for the pass and got a hand on it. Great job to force the fourth down right there. Fourth and eight. West Virginia ready to put this one away. Arnold is waiting for the snap. He gets it away. Ball fields it at the 40. The offense comes back down the field, hoping to build off their last drive. It's all about execution, my friends. We saw them move the football, but they were unable to move it when it mattered most. Lee, well, I think you have to give credit to this defense. They tightened up when they had to, and they're going to look to do the same here. Look at the throw. He's looking for his man. This one is incomplete. Quarter was the intended target on the play. That'll bring up second down. Receiver on the play. Second down, 10 yards to go. 40 yard line. He looks. He throws. And he's tackled in the open field. So they pick up a few with a pass play, Coach. Yeah, it was. I like plays like these. As long as you're moving forward and not backward, you're doing pretty good. Third it's third and three. three. Ball at the 47-yard The Buckeyes come to the line with their jumbo package. Garcia with the tackle at midfield. And that'll be good enough to move the sticks. Great run. And now... We've got a new set of downs. First, First down, 10 to go. Johnson comes to the line with three wide. He looks to throw on first down. Moves up in the pocket. He snags it. Excellent open field tackle. That was a laser, Kirk. This guy has a huge arm. Yeah, it's like he's throwing darts, but it's coming at about 86 miles an hour. From the 41-yard line, second and short. They line up in the shotgun. 
The Buckeye with four receivers. Clayton brings him down at the 39. First We've got a first and ten. Ball on the Ball 39 yard line. They'll work from the shotgun. Run right side. Copeland with a takedown at the 26. So with that run, they pick up another first. It's a nice job again up front by the offensive line. They're doing a good job of neutralizing the defensive front, and it's allowed them to move the ball down the field. First, first and ten. Ball 26 yard line. Six yard line. The Buckeye line up with two tight ends. Johnson with the play fake. Johnson throws it out there. And the quarterback aired it out, but too far. Yeah, great try by the receiver. Technically, he caught the pass, but he won't get credit for the catch because he was out of bounds. Second, Second and down ten. and 10 to go. The Buckeyes line up in an eye formation. You'll get the call again. And they make the stop at the 22-yard line. Hall gains about four yards on the play. So another third down upcoming for the offense. They're really struggling now as this crowd is going absolutely insane. Stepping up, throws it out there. It's complete. Copeland with the tackle at the 19-yard line. Oh, man, he doesn't get the first great play by the defense. Incredible. They saw that coming a mile away. I think you got to give your quarterback a little bit more time, especially on fourth down. It's fourth down, and they'll attempt the field goal. This one from about 36 yards out. This to try to put his team up by a field goal. He gets it up, and he got it. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. And Fry set to return. Kicks off. Fry fields it at the one. The offense comes back on the field, hoping to build off their last drive. Well, they had something going, but were unable to get any points. Well, this drive will start at the 20. Take over at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Britton with three wide receivers. And he's taken down at the 32-yard line. First down, First 10 to go. 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. Yard line. The Mountaineers come out showing three wide. And he's tackled at the 35 to 12. The ball carrier, three-yard gain on the play. Second, Second down, seven. seven yards to go. Ball on their own 35. They line up in the shotgun. A little juke, and they make the stop at the 38-yard line with the carry. Three-yard gain on the play. Third From their own 38-yard line, on the 30 it's third down. Line. They're in the eye. Rivera takes it up the middle. 
And he has room to rumble. Good open field tackle. What a run on third down. You know, we're always talking about the importance of converting on third down. If you're going to have any kind of success, you got to be able to keep these drives alive, like they did right there. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 50. West Virginia sets up with four receivers. Watson hits the ball left side, and he's taken down at the 48-yard line. Rose is walking off the field now, and the trainers are going to have a close look at him. It doesn't look like it's too bad, but the trainers are going to take a look anyway. Second, Second down. down. Ace backfield. They hand it off again. Tackle made at the 43-yard line. Watson picks up five with the carry. That'll bring up third down. Third the defense will try to stop this All third down the as they were unsuccessful line. the first time on this drive. with a carry. Brought down at the 41-yard line. And they just stuffed that one. Hey, this is a great play here by the defense to bring him down before he could get to the sticks. Fourth and one. The Mountaineers find a one-yard line. Williams is back deep to return. Punts the ball away. Calls for the fair catch. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll take over and the 20. Johnson, back to the gun. With a takedown at the 25. Second They'll line up at the 25. On the 25 Second down. The Buckeye come out in the ace formation. Johnson drops back to pass. Throws down the middle. And it's incomplete. The ball is roughly separated from the receiver by the defender. And that's the way you play defense. Rough and tough with no apologies. Third down. Lining up with three receivers. Drops back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Down the middle. And it's the tight end. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz. And the quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. First, it's ten. first and ten. Ball on the 39 yard line. Feeds it to the back. Good move. And they make the stop at the 45-yard line. Paul gets six yards on the play. Second, Second and four coming up here. Ball on the 45. The Buckeyes line up with a single set backfield. him up. Jones with the tackle at the 48. Three-yard gain by the running back. Third, Third down. The Buckeyes are lining up with three receivers. Ball will run it again. Garcia with a takedown at the 49. 
Third down has been the charm on this drive. Now it's been all about execution. When it comes to calling the right play at the right time, they've been able to do it here. Right. First, First down. down. Ball, Ball on the, the Buckeye yard. Line up with a single setback to it. Johnson flips it right. Spinning. Jones brings him down for a loss. No place to go that time, and the offense loses a yard or two. Nice job of plugging up all the gaps in the possible cutback lanes by the defense. They line up at the 48. Second down, 13 yards to go. The Buckeye come out in the shotgun. Johnson drops to throw. Throws it to the outside. Tackle made at the 33-yard line. And they're building some great momentum on this drive, guys. That's right, Brad. That was a crisp pass by the quarterback. And they're looking pretty good moving the ball right now. First, first down. Ball on the 33-yard line. The Buckeye with four receivers. It's a direct snap. And he's tackled at the 28-yard line. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. They line up at the 28. Ball, ball, second and five coming up here. Yeah. Ohio State lines up in a shotgun set. Yeah. Yeah. Shake and bake move. And he hits him hard at the 28. The Buckeye line up with a single setback to you. He's looking to pass. He steps up, looking. He passes it. Incomplete pass. That's going to bring up fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. It's up. And they tack on three points. Pretty good kick right there, and it wasn't an easy one. They did everything right. It was a good snap, a good hold, and then a good kick. but the coach gave his offense quite a speech before he sent him out there. And let's not forget, they had some things clicking the last time out. He's probably just reminding them to finish the job this time. Right. They'll set the up shot at the 20. Take over at the 20-yard line. First and 10. West Virginia in a four-wide set. They snap it to the back. He's tackled at the 21. Watson picks up a yard on the play. From their own 21-yard line. Ball it's ball second down and nine to go. Line. West Virginia comes out of the shotgun. Makes the move. And he's tackled on the 23-yard area. Gain of two on the play. Third and third seven. down. The defense is playing the pass on this one. Fakes to the back. He zips it out to the right. At the 40. Brown fumbles. <laughs> the Mountaineers come out showing three wide.
Drops back to pass. He passes it. He snags it. The ball came free. Recovered by the defense. They work hard and they got the turnover. Well, this is what it's all about. Defense taking advantage of an opportunity. They're pouncing on the loose ball. They're going to flag the celebration there. After this is the goal, first down. Shotgun. Inside handoff. They'll bring him down at the 18. And the offensive line did a good job of picking up the blitz. Yep, the defense over pursued the play and it helped them get some good yards. Second, Second and 11, 11 coming up. Ball at the 18. 18 yard line. From the gun. Johnson steps back to pass, and it's caught. Garcia with the tackle at the 24. That was a good completion there. Yeah, I really liked the good, clean routes they ran on that play. Third, Third down. Five. Johnson has four receivers lined up here. Back to pass. Johnson throws, brought down at the 30. Pretty good looking first down there, Kirk. Well, it was third down, so they obviously had to get to the sticks, and they did just that with this little pass play. First We've got ten. a first and 10. The Buckeye line up in an eye formation. First down, look at the throw. Johnson passes. He's tackled in the open field. No gain. Second, Second and ten. ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. Johnson gives it up the middle. Sheds that one. Perkin brings him down at the 31-yard line. And we've come to the end of the first quarter with the score, Ohio State 6, West Virginia nothing. Third so another nine. third down All upcoming for the offense. Yard line. Ohio State lines up with three receivers. Again, defense hasn't stopped him yet. Throws this one out to the right. But he caught it, but failed to get that one necessary foot in. That's an outstanding catch, and he just missed making a big time play. Fourth and nine. It's fourth down Ball now, and we'll see the punt team. Picking awaits the snap. He punts it. Calls for the fair catch. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. They'll get the ball here at the 32-yard line. Watson gets a pitch. Tackle for a loss. He just went right through him. Man, who was supposed to block that guy? I don't think it matters, Kurt. He's playing with reckless abandon out there. It's got to be hard to block a guy that hits like that. Second, Second down. Team. West Virginia in a five-wide set. And they'll bring him down behind the line. The on the carry. Awesome. On the play. Third. 
third it's third down and 15 to go. West Virginia comes out of the shotgun. Looking to throw. Steps up. He's looking. Throws this one out to the left. The true freshman has it. So he drags his feet and picks up the first down. This wasn't the best pass we've ever seen from this quarterback, but his receiver certainly could have saved him by making a wonderful catch. You can put the ball anywhere near this guy, and he'll usually catch it, coach. Here are the offensive production stats, brought to you today by Coca-Cola. Watson, alone in the backfield. Britton, with a nice play fake. Let's it go. Got his man on the run. Did you see what I saw there, Cook? I don't know. It looked like to me that he just got beaten man-to-man -man cover. He sure did. These guys are going to have to do a better job of locking down their man and preventing passes like that. They line up at the 34. First down. Tackles him behind the line for a loss on the play. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed it. Second, Second down, 12. about 12 yards to go. Ball on the 36. West Virginia in a five-wide set. Britain back to throw. Complete, what a catch. And he threw that ball in there nicely. Did you see that, Coach? Yes, I did, Brad. And that was a good pass and a very good game. Third They'll line it two. up again on third down. Ball on the 26-yard line. They come out with three wide receivers. And they'll run them again. Tackle at the 25-yard line. He'll be stopped just short of a first down. Ah, so close yet so far away. I thought he had it. There's a flag down, and here's the call. First down. They're threatening inside the 20. West Virginia lines up in a shotgun set. Britton goes with a play fake. He throws left, and they'll score. The quarterback threw a pretty ball there for the touchdown. But don't forget about the catch. The receiver made one heck of a grab, too. Here's the extra point that can give them the lead. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Better than 12 minutes remaining in the first half. And the score reads, West Virginia, 7, Ohio State, 6. Get set to kick this one away. Decent kick. Carter takes it at the eight. They're just about ready to get this drive started. 
After their last series, had some promise, but it ended with a punt. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coca-Cola. Johnson off the fake. Throws it. It's tipped. Nice yeah, job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads-up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. That'll make it second down. Second it's ten. second and ten. Ball, Ball, Ball of the 21. Yard. Johnson is back in the gun. Make the stop at the 30-yard line. Third, Third down. One. Ball on the 30-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. They'll run for the first on third and short. That didn't go anywhere. Yeah, I'll tell you why. They were coming with a heavy blitz, and guys were shooting through the line right into the backfield. That play didn't have a chance. Fourth and one, and they're ready to pump this one away. Garcia, the return man. He gets it away. Garcia fields it to 31. So they beat this defense up through the air on their last drive. Let's see if they can replicate that performance this time around. They'll go to work at the 34. First and 10. The Mountaineers set up in the gun. He delivers. And this one falls incomplete. He just couldn't connect with a wide receiver there. Second, Second down and 10 to go. Ball in yard 34. Drops back to pass. Throws. The way to look it in. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. They line up at the 38. Third down, six to go. Britton with three wide receivers. Slings it. Got his man on the run. Defense was coming with heat on that play. Yeah, okay, the offensive line did a good job of picking up their assignments. That gave the quarterback enough time to throw a nice pass and pick up the first down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 45. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. The Mountaineers line up with five receivers. He jukes. Reese with the tackle at the 40. The ball carrier, five-yard gain on the play. From the 40-yard line, second down and five. West Virginia lines up with three receivers. Britton. Makes the handoff. Oh, great catch. Good picked up by the receiver. Yeah, this kid loves the play. He wants the ball every time they pull it up. First and 10. Ball on the 21. West Virginia lines up for the shotgun set. Looks. Flips it, complete, and he's taken down at the 17-yard line. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. Right. 
And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. Another trip to the red zone. Last time, it resulted in a touchdown. They're going to pitch it. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. And that was a good stop by the defense. They got him in the backfield. That's a great example of quickness by the defensive line. It allows you to break away from those blockers before they have a chance of moving you away from the play. Third, so another nine. third down Ball upcoming the for the offense. West Virginia comes out with five receivers. Britton drops back to pass. Britton right over the right. And it's intercepted. And that's his seventh pick of the season. This kid has been around the football this entire season. You'd think they would try their boy throwing the ball his way. Well, for all you quarterbacks out there who haven't played this team yet, here's a tip for you. Don't throw the ball towards this guy. The He'll start this drive. The 20-yard will start the ball is the single center. First and 10. Side handoff. He jukes him. At the 40. Across midfield. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown! Oh, wow. I can't believe it. What an amazing run. And how about the fact that not one player on the entire defense even touched it? Kirk, we've got 11 guys on the field, and he just blew by all of them. Here's the kicking team to try the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. Garcia fields it in the end zone. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. Here are the offensive production stats brought to you today by Coca-Cola. West Virginia sets up in the eye, lets it fly. That's incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. Second it's and second ten. and ten. Ball, ball, ball on the 16-yard line. Yeah. Britton has four receivers lined up here. Watson off the right side. Oh, man. He took him down hard. That was a fantastic play by this defense. <laughs> You're right. Four halfbacks. He had nowhere to go. Third We've got third and, and ten. ten. Ball on their own 16. The Mountaineers set up in the gun. Back to pass. Look. He lets it go. And it falls incomplete. Hayden was the intended receiver on that pass. And that'll bring up a punting situation. Fourth and ten. The Mountaineers line up to punt. Paul is the deep man awaiting the return. He gets it off. Paul takes it to 45. And we see this offense again after what you could call a very physical touchdown drive. Well, I say that, Brad, because the big hog mollies up front were able to create holes for the running game, and it helped them get the score. Let's see if they can do it again. They'll start this drive at midfield. First and 10. Ohio State comes out in the shotgun. Johnson hands it 
off. Moyer tackles him for a loss on the play. Nowhere to go on that play, Coach. Boy, you're absolutely right, Brad. This is a great job by the defense in not giving him any room to create anything. It's second down now and 13 to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. Ball is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Brought down at the 48-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. From their own 48-yard line. Third down, 10 yards to go. The offense is doing everything they can just to call the plays, and right now, they're not having much luck at all. Looking, this one's thrown deep over the middle. And he got it! I'll tell you, this guy has just had a great year catching the football. I know, Kirk. Every week, this kid does nothing but catch touchdown pass. I can see now why this quarterback calls him his favorite target. Whenever this guy's near the end zone, he gets in the ball. So the kicker's on the field to attempt the extra point. And he converts the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Sends it off. Fry has it at the five. Not a whole lot of success their last time out. Not at all. This offense has to do a better job of staying on the field and giving their defense a chance to catch their breath. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coca-Cola. Britain with four wide receivers. He looks to throw on first down. Let's it fly. The ball is tipped. The How about that defense? Well, that's why he's on the field, to make plays like that. So that'll make it second down. Right. Second, and second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 21-yard line. West Virginia lines up in a shotgun set. He drops back. He airs it out. Incomplete pass. And in with the intended target. That'll make it third down. Right. Third, third down, ten, 10 yards to go. Ohio State comes out defensively with six defensive backs. He's looking to pass. Looks. He's going to go for the home run. It's deflected. And he got it! Fellas, he's really out to an outstanding start in this football game. Hey, if he continues at this pace, he may throw for 500 yards. I'll tell you what, this guy is so much fun to watch when he gets into a rhythm like this. From the 28-yard line, first down. Three wide outs here. Makes a move. Sanders tackles him at the 23. Watson comes away with five yards on the carry. From the 23-yard line. Second and five coming up here. The defense lines up with six DBs. Looking. He rolls out to the right. It's tipped. This one will fall incomplete. Watson was the intended receiver on the play. So that'll make it third down. So another third down upcoming for the offense. They'll work from the shotgun. Looks to pass. 
He's looking down the middle. And that one's incomplete. He's unable to hit his receiver. He overthrew it. Yeah, and that's a throw he should make every single time. They're going to try a long field goal here. The ball's on the 23, so this will be about a 40-yarder. The kick is up, and it's through the uprights. Not a bad kick to get your team three points, Kirk. Yeah, he got some good leg behind it, and he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. Everyone's all lined, lined up and up ready for the kickoff. For the kickoff. Decent kick. Carter fields it at the seven. He gets it. Let's see if this defense has trouble defending the pass again here. If they do, my friend, look out. They're going to give up another touchdown in a hurry. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics. Brought to you by Coke. They use four linebackers. Johnson with the play fake. Throws. And they couldn't hook up on that one. Williams was the intended target. That'll bring up second down. Second it's second down and 10 to go. All on the 33 yard line. High formation here. Brings him down at the 33 yard line. And what a big hit by that defender. He laid a lick into him. Third it's third down. down. And on third and long, watch out. This quarterback's looking to keep the drive alive. And he tackles him hard. At the 44. Now that's what you have to do on third and long. Yep, he went right at him and hit him in the mouth. That's a great conversion to get the first down. formation here they go with a run right with a takedown at the 45 and the fullback plows ahead for maybe a yard third so another nine. third down Ball upcoming for the offense going with the shotgun here Johnson set to go to the air he throws and it's a true freshman. Garcia with the tackle at the 36 yard line. Nice play call to get on the conversion. When a team converts on third down, they can really frustrate a defense. When they converted third and long, it just makes them sick. First it's first ten. down. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He passes it. Incomplete pass. And that was out of reach for his tight end. Second, 
second, second down. down. Ohio State in a four wide set. The running back has it. Moyer with a takedown at the 35 yard line. Hall gains about a yard on the play. That'll bring up third down. Third they line up for another third down, and they've had no problem converting their first two. Ohio State sets up in the eye. Drops back to pass. Let's it go. And it's caught. Bryant tackles him at the 27-yard line. Good pass and a good completion, but they'll still be short of the first down. It's always tough to get a first down in those third and long situations. Fourth and it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down. They're crowding the line. They bust up the play and stop them on fourth down. Well, they'll turn it over on down. Did they have to go for it there? Well, sometimes you got to take your chances. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. First down. Virginia Mountaineers take over at the 28-yard line. First and 10. West Virginia comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. That's a great tackle at the 26-yard line. Oh, man. He'll feel that much more. That's called making a statement. When you get into the backfield like that and put somebody on their back, it really sends a message. Second, Second and 12, 12 coming up here. Ball, ball on the 26-yard 26 26 line. Yard line. West Virginia goes with the ace set here. Watson on the run. And down he goes at the 27-yard line. A one-yard gain by the halfback. Third From their own 27-yard line. On the 27 it's third yard down. Line. Is an impact player, and on third and long, you better expect him to make a play. Nice pass, but not enough for the first down, and I that's going to bring I know, up four. I know, yeah, but nice pass and catch. But when you don't convert the first down, it's not as nice as you'd like. Fourth and two. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Hall is back deep to return. Punts the ball away. Hall fields it at the 27. A constant defense heads out onto the field after stopping this offense on a fourth down attempt the last time they were on the field. And the last thing you want to do is to come out and do nothing again and give them even more confidence. They'll First take down. over at the 33 yard line. First and 10. The Buckeyes line up with four wide out. Throws it to the outside. Got it. He's all the way down to the 40. What a display of pure arm strength. This kid has been throwing hard his whole life. He can really let it go. There have been 22 Heisman Trophy winners playing quarterback. This guy has everything to be number 23. First from the 40-yard line. On the first down. Yard line. The Buckeye set up in the gun. Johnson on first down. Johnson with a bullet to the right. Good open field tackle. Three, maybe four yards on the pass. Gain of four on the play. Second it's second down, six. six yards Ball to go. On the 36 Ball on the 36. Line. Johnson lines up in the shotgun. The running back has it. And he's tackled at the 34-yard line. A two-yard run by the halfback. Third, Third down. 
Ball at the 34 yard line. He delivers. He gets another, and this is a big one. And he makes his second visit to the end zone with that catch. Oh, that was a great catch by the receiver. He ran a perfect route to get open for his second score of the game. So the kicking team will line up for the point after. And he adds the extra point. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. He just drills this one. Garcia fields it in the end zone. This defense did a good job on the last series. They forced the offense to go three plays and out. And now they're looking to build off of that and shut them down again right here. They'll, They'll set up shot at the 19-yard line. First and 10. The Mountaineers line up with four oh. wideouts. Fake to the back. He lets it go. And he brings it down. And he's tackled in the open field. Oh, man, they had him good there. The defense was looking to run, and they threw it for a big game. The running back really sold the run well that time. That allowed for the quarterback to get the ball downfield for a decent game. First down, 10 yards to go. Britton lines up with three receivers on his right. The ball is tipped. The quarterback had a tough time with a blitz on that one. Now with this guy, you can't let him stand back there and have too much time to throw the ball. You've got to get a hand in his face. Second down, 10 yards to go. Britton lines up with five wide out. Britton steps back to pass. Catches it. Noah with the tackle at the 34-yard line. Didn't get anything. They line up at the 34. It's third down and 10. Ohio State brings in their nickel package. Looks. He's looking for his man. It's oh, deflected, and, and that makes it fourth down. Boy, great defense on that play. They were expecting the pass, and they defended it very well by getting a hand in there to break up the play. Fourth and ten. The punt team is on the field looking to kick this one away. Arnold awaits the snap. He gets it off. Paul takes it to 25. Loose football. And the defense picks it up. Wow, very close to turning it over, but they'll keep possession of the football. Way to play heads up out there. That's just one more reason to play to the whistle. They'll, they'll take, take the ball here at the 26-yard line. line. First and 10. Ohio State in a four-wide set. Johnson lines up with four wideouts. Johnson back to throw. Look in. And he's hit as he throws. You got to be careful throwing into coverage like that. Well, Coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It was just a great reaction by the man in coverage. Second, Second and 10. All on their own 26. Yard line. Johnson lines up in the shotgun. Johnson hands it off. Perkins. Brings him down for a loss. West Virginia will take a timeout. That's their second of the half.
Third and 12. Ball on their own 24. The defense sets up in the dive. He's going left. Got it to his receiver. And that reception gives him 1,500 yards for the year. I'll tell you what, this kid's really having a big year. Not only does he have the receiving numbers, but he's helped his team win a few games along the way. And that's what counts most, winning football games. All those individual accolades are great, but winning is priority number one for everybody. They come out in a nickel. They'll throw on first down. Throws it. Complete block hit. Ohio State will take their second time out of the half. They line up at the 45. It's first down. Ohio State goes with the ace set here. Drops back on first down. He's looking. Rolls to the left. Johnson throws it out there. Yo, guys, that was a very dangerous pass. This quarterback better be careful. He has a tendency to force some passes, and he really forced that one. Second so it's 10. second and 10. Ball, Ball on the 45-yard line. line. And we'll probably see how far he can throw it, as it should be the last play before the half. He's looking to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He looks. Johnson slings it left. That it ball. Incomplete pass. pass. Carter was the intended receiver on the play. So that'll make it third down. Third They'll line it up ten. again on third ball down. On the 45 yard line. So we'll probably get one last heave to the end zone here before halftime. And that defense is getting a little excited down there. Offsides on the defense. And the defense gives up some free yards to the offense. Oh, you know, penalties can ruin a team's chances to win if they commit too many. This defense faces another third down. Back to pass. Stepping up, looking. He heaves it deep. It's deflected. He gets another, and this is a big one. It's not halftime yet, sweetheart. Did you see that? Oh, that just kills everything this defense has worked for in this first half. You can't let him score with no time. I just think that was a great play. It got some people out of their seats, that's for sure. They'll line it up for the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. And that'll do it for the first half of play. Our halftime score, Ohio State 34, West Virginia 10. set to start the second half. Both teams are on the field and we're ready to go. He got all of that one. Fry fields it in the end zone. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll go to work. Take over at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Four wide. Britain on first down. Across the middle. At the 40. Across midfield. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. The wideout makes a big catch there. Hey, whenever you have a receiver who can make plays like that, you just want to get the ball in his hands and let him do the work. Listen up, my friend. That was a tremendous throw by the quarterback, too. Don't forget about the guy slinging the ball all over the field out there.
So the kicker is going to stay on the sidelines. These guys will try for a two-point conversion. West Virginia comes out in the shotgun. Park tackles him behind the line for awesome the play. They went for two, but they're stopped short. The defense just rolled up their sleeves and went in there and stopped them when they had to. West Virginia, ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off. Hall fields it at the nine. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Clipping on the receiving team. That one has put the offense in a hole, and they'll try to get some of that back on this upcoming play. They'll this drive will start at the 12. Yard line. First and 10. Single set back to you. Johnson with the give, and they make the stop at the 13. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. From their own 13-yard line. Second down. Paul lines up as a single back. And there's a fumble. And they fall on the loose ball. And that fumble recovery may give this defense the spark they needed. You're right. This could be a huge swing in momentum. First and ten. We'll see what they can do in the red zone. The West Virginia Mountaineers will start the drive at the 20-yard line. Three wideouts here. Here's the give. And he's taken down at the 12. They grab eight yards there. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. They're in the red zone, but that doesn't necessarily mean points. Last time, they got intercepted. Let's see, did one of the linemen move first? Offside, on the defense. Five yard penalty, first down. They get about five yards from the halfback. Second We've got and second and goal. All on the two. All on the two. West Virginia comes to the line with three wide. McKenzie brings him down for a loss. Great job by the defensive lineman here to get a paw on him and put him to the turf. Third here we go, goal. third and goal Ball from the three-yard three line. Looks like they're going to try to power this one in. They hand off on the counter. Brought down at the one. I don't really know what this one's for. Let's find out. So it's fourth down. He shouldn't have a problem with this one. It's up, and it splits the uprights. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary.
Arnold. Gets set to kick this one away. He kicks it. Carter takes it at the four. The last time they had the ball, they gave it away on the fumble. The old ball coach was not too happy about that either. I'd hate to see that if it happens again. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coke. The Buckeye. Go with the eye formation. Blue 19, blue 19. <laughs> and they make the stop at the 28. Six-yard pickup. Second it's second two. down and four to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. line. Johnson with three wide receivers. Tackle made at the 30. Third and two coming up here. Ball on the 30-yard line. Ball is a deep back as they line up in the eye. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Wow, it's not often you see a safety making a play in the backfield like that. Well, these days you've got safeties playing up close to the line of scrimmage, almost like a fourth linebacker. The only way that you can keep them from cheating up is take some chances downfield. Garcia will be the return man. He punts it. Garcia takes it to 36. Ball's loose. Offense falls on it. And that is a big, big turnover. It looks like to me that someone got the helmet on that ball. First, First and 10. Ball, ball on the 47 yard line. Yard. Backfield. Throws it out there. And he's got him on the run. Fumble. Loose ball. And they couldn't have asked for a better time for the turnover. Right, Herbie? Well, I'm sure they could have used a couple of these earlier in the game, but better late than never. They'll set up shot at the 29-yard line. Britton with the gear. He's tackled. At the 36. A nice seven-yard run by the fullback. Second it's second down. down. Ball on the 36-yard line. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Got hit as he threw. And it's incomplete. Not a pretty pass right there. No, it wasn't, Kirk. That was not a good pass at all. But hey, in his defense, he had to get it off to avoid the sack. Third Here's a third and three. three. Ball on the 36-yard line. The Mountaineers come to the line with their jumbo package. Toss to the right. Can he get to the sticks? That's not going to move the sticks. Now, this defense played some sound football out there and did a good job of not letting him get into any kind of rhythm. Fourth and three. The Mountaineers the line up the punt. Yard line. Arnold is waiting for the snap. He gets it off. Ball takes it to 25, breaks one. He couldn't shake anybody. He needs to go work out those legs a little bit. Yeah, Coach, you're right. Pretty good return. But if he could have broken that last tackle, that might have been big. They'll take over the at the 32-yard line. First and 10. Johnson lines up in the shotgun. Hunter brings him down for a loss. The halfback just couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage. Loss of one. It's second down.
down and 11 to go. Ball on the 31-yard line. And this offense is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. Pitch out. And he's taken down at the 33-yard line. A yard, maybe two on the carry. Third, now it's nine. third and nine coming up. Ball on the 33 yard line. They come out with four wide out. Johnson drops back to pass. He steps up. Johnson is going to be sacked for a loss. He just blew past the blockers and dragged the quarterback down. Boy, excellent play by the defense here. A few extra seconds, and those receivers might have been open. Fourth and long. The Buckeyes line up the punt. Garcia is back to receive. Punts the ball away. Garcia fields it at the 39. So the offense takes over. And the last time they had the ball, they had a tough time getting anything going. The offense will start at the 46 yard line. At the 46 yard line. First and 10. Britton drops to throw. Surveys the field. He lets it go. Brings it down to the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, and it ain't over yet. They made a great connection there for the touchdown, didn't they, fellas? What a quarterback threw a strike to the wide receiver. He caught it and took it all away. Well, what a dangerous combination. You can't say enough about how good that throw was. The quarterback put that one right on the money. And he hits the PAT. West Virginia is lining up to kick this one off. Paul and Carter back to return. And this one's away. Paul has it at the five. Breaks one. Well, the offense couldn't get anything going on their last drive. Let's see if they can do a little bit better here. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coke. The Buckeyes line up with a single set backfield. Johnson delivers. They can't connect in the sweeps. Carter was the intended target. That'll make it second down. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 28-yard line. The Mountaineers line up with six defensive backs. Johnson lets it go. Mm -hmm. It's going to go down as a drop, my friend. Mm -hmm. A very frustrating drop. I like the play call. I like the pass even more, but it really doesn't matter if the receiver can't bring it in. They line up at the 28. Third down. Ohio State goes with the ace set here. Back to pass. He throws it, and it's caught. Brought down at the 34-yard line. It'll be short of the first after the completion. A good effort by the defense to make sure they got him before he got to the mark. They line up to punt this one away. Garcia is back awaiting the punt. He gets it off. Garcia takes it to 28. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. First down. The 
the Mountaineers set up in the gun. First down, look at the throw. Quick throw. He makes a circus catch. And this is one of the finest performances you'll ever see by a quarterback. An excellent day for this young man throwing the football. That last pass puts him over 400 yards for the game. He's looking really sharp today. First, First down, down, 10 to go on the 36 36. Britain has four receivers lined up here. Britain hands it off. They'll bring him down at the 33. Watson gains around three yards on the run. Second the second and down seven. and seven to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. West Virginia lines up with three receivers. Britton zips it. But he's taken down at the 24-yard line. White looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 24. They'll spread the field with five wide. Britain looking to throw on first down. That is ball. And that one's fallen incomplete. That's just good defense right there, Coach. It was, Kirk. But you know what? It's all reaction. Anytime you're out there on defense and the pass is within arm's length away, you knock it down. That'll make it second down. Second, Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. Britton lines up with four wideouts. Britton steps back to pass. Let's it fly. It falls incomplete. Great play. That's how you make someone drop the football. Let them know you're there and then, wow, put your pads on them. That's the way you make it hard to catch the ball. I will say that. I agree. Third and 10. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 24. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Moves up in the pocket. He unloads it. He's going to take it to the barn. Touchdown. They hooked up for the long touchdown there, guys. What a great call. The quarterback knew he had the matchup that he wanted, and he took advantage of it. And how about that receiver? He made a great catch. They need to tie it up here, and that's exactly why they're going for two. Well, if they want to tie this thing up, they need to convert right here. And they won't get the two. Arnold looks ready to kick this one off. He sends it off. Carter takes it from the six. You guys remember what this offense did the last time they had the ball? Did they have the ball before? Exactly. It was three and out so fast they had to ask for slow-mo replay to recap it. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics. Brought to you by Coke. Johnson is back in the gun. Johnson looking to throw on first down. It's complete. Copeland tackles him at the 41-yard line. Nice job by the quarterback to hit the tight end for a decent game. Yeah, this guy's not going to burn too many guys deep, but he's definitely a good possession guy who you can rely on. Second and one. Ball on the 41. 
They come out with three wide receivers. Johnson, back to pass. Let's it go. And it's caught. He's tackled at the 50-yard line. They brought the house on that one. And this kid shows a lot of poise and moxie in the pocket. He knew he was going to get hit, but he hung in there and delivered the ball with accuracy. First it's first and ten. ten. Ball on the 50. Johnson lines up in the shotgun. Juku. And he's tackled at the 43. Second From the 43-yard line, on the 43 second down, yard line. Ohio State comes out with an eye formation. Little shake and bake move, and they got him for a loss. Loss of two on the run by the halfback. Third down, third and five. The Buckeyes line up with four wideouts. Johnson options out. He jukes. Now he pitches it, and he hits him hard at the 43-yard line. A yard, maybe two on the carry. the deep man awaiting the return. Pickens punts it, and it doesn't look like he got all of that one. Signals for a fair catch. Well, the offense heading back out into the field after that kick. Over to turn this drive into another touchdown. They'll start over at the 13-yard line. First and 10. West Virginia comes out in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. Brought down at the 24. The wideout made a good looking grab there. You're right, and the quarterback threw it as soon as he saw he had that extra step. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coke. Britton comes to the line with three wide. Drops back on first down. He'll dump this one off. Nobody covering the tight end, and he's got it. And they pick up two yards. Second, Second down. down. Ball on the 26-yard line. Watson on the give. Makes a move. Tackle at the 27. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. Third, third down seven. and seven to go. Ball, Ball on the 27-yard line. West Virginia lines up with three receivers. He lets it go. He wasn't letting the receiver get to that one. That's a big play on third down to get a hand in there and break up the pass. I think the quarterback would like to have that one back. Four for the seven. The Mountaineers line up the punt. Paul, the return man. He punts it. Paul fields it at the 40. So the offense takes over. And they'll try to figure out this defense forced them to punt the last time they had the ball. They'll set up shot at the 42-yard line. Paul lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. Jones tackles him for a loss on the play. The big fella couldn't get any momentum going. It's tough to get this guy down in the backfield. He's always falling forward. And on that one, they hit him before he could get his weight going forward. 
Second, Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. The Buckeyes are lining up with three receivers. Johnson drops back to pass. The ball is tipped. A fantastic play by the cornerback. All you young defensive backs at home, that is how you play defense. Third down. Ball on the 41 yard line. The Buckeye come out showing three wide. Steps up. He looks. Johnson zips it left. Got it. And he's all the way down to the 22 yard line. And that reception put him over 100 yards on the day. Well, this guy is such a big part of this offense. If he doesn't get his numbers, they usually don't have much success moving the football. And that's why he's so valuable to this football team, Kirk. He's a big time college football player. First, First and 10. Ball of the 22. 22 yard line. The defense sets up with five defensive linemen. Johnson off the fake. Complete. What a catch. The tight end with a nice catch there. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. The Buckeye line up with a single setback. They get it out there on the toss. He spins. He tackles him for a loss. So the toss to the halfback doesn't work. That's a loss of about three on the play. zone stats so far this season. What do you think, Lee? Well, if they're inside the 20, you better not go anywhere because somebody is about to score. The Mountaineer line up in a nickelback. On the ground with a tailback. Woodard with the tackle at the four. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. Third this is a goal. big play for the offense that can put them up by two scores. It's third down from the four. Gives it up the gut. A little juke. Touchdown, Buckeyes. This kid just seems to live in the end zone, fella. That was his 20th touchdown of the season. What an amazing year. <laughs> You're not kidding. There are a lot of guys that wish they could have that many touchdowns in their career, let alone one season. They'll line it up for the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. So with less than two to go in the third quarter, our score, Ohio State 41, West Virginia 32. Lines up for the kickoff. And this one's away. He kicks it off out of bounds, and that's going to be a penalty. Illegal procedure on the kicking team. The ball is at the 35. They'll be set up with good First field down. position after the kicker sent that one out of bounds. It's the kicker's job to send that ball deep, so he messed up big time. Ball West Virginia. Now go to work at the 35 yard line. The 35 yard line. First and 10. Britain lines up in the shotgun. Juku. Reese brings him down. 12-35. No gain on the play. Second it's second ten. down. Ball on the 35-yard line. The Mountaineers come out in the ace formation. Watson takes the toss left. 
Man, I sure wouldn't want to be hit by that kid. That's not baby fat on him anymore. He weighs 300 pounds plus. I don't know if I'd be calling him a kid. Well, I'm not the one out there taking the hits either, my friend. Third and ten. It's third down and ten. Ball on the 35. They come out with three wide receivers. Britton steps back to pass. Across the middle. Got it to his receiver. Good job of attacking the coverage to keep the drive alive. That was a great looking pass to move the sticks on third down. First and ten. Ball on their own 47. First and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. Britton comes to the line with three wide. Britton drops back to pass. Comes across the middle. Sanders with a takedown at the 47-yard line. So they go to the air and pick up six. Second it's second and four. Ball, ball, ball right around midfield. West Virginia comes out with an eye formation. A little juke. He's taken down at the 47. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Third From the 47-yard line, it's third and four. So that brings us to the end of the quarter, and at the end of three, our score, Ohio State 41, West Virginia 32. Third the defense will try to stop Ball this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. High formation here. Play fake. He's going left. He's hit and taken down. Our cameraman didn't even know who had the ball. I'm pretty sure the defense didn't either. The half has did a heck of a job faking like he was running with the ball. Hit. They were about to tackle him. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. West Virginia comes out in the shotgun. Britain hasn't missed yet. He passes it. Complete. What a catch. Brown loses the handle. And the defense is on it. The linebacker made a heads-up play to recover that fumble. Boy, I'll say he did. He knew right where to be. There's a flag down, and here's the call. That's more than one After this is going to go, first down. Loses the football, and they make the stop at the four. And that's going to give these guys a chance. I'll tell you what, Kirk, they needed to force a turnover there, and that defense jumped on the football. Now all they need to do is come up with some big plays and put some points on the board in a hurry. So they'll start this drive inside the red zone. The Mountaineers will start the drive at the four-yard line. They line up in the shotgun. Britain hands off. Sanders brings him down for a loss. And the defense just swarmed over him on that one. Yeah, they were able to penetrate the offensive line and get to the running back before that play even had a chance. The pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. Sweep left. He's hit and got away. And he gets peppered. That toss had no room to work as the defense had the hot pursuit. And they just scorched the field to get to him. I can see where the turf is going.
West Virginia comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Britton drops back. Looks. Got hit as he threw. And I think the pressure forced that miscue, guys. Yeah, good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Fourth down. And the field goal unit's out to try this 27-yarder. Arnold can bring his team back within a touchdown. He gets it up, and it's through the uprights. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Looks ready to kick this one off. He sends it off. Carter fields it at the 7. Shifty move there at the 30. Well, guys, their last drive ended on a fumbled ball. What do you think they can do to be more successful this time? Well, for one, they can hold on to the football. Turnovers absolutely kill the team's momentum. Yeah, I just think they have to be a little bit more careful with the ball. This drive will start at the 37. Ohio State lines up for the shotgun set. Johnson to the air on first down. Garcia brings him down at the 42-yard line. That screen pass nets maybe five yards. It's second down. Ball on the 42-yard line. Johnson on play action. Throws it. He gets another, and this is a big one. Lee, this offense is having some fun out there. You betcha. This quarterback just exceeded 400 yards passing for the game, and I'm going to tell you why he's having all that success. The reason? The play of those receivers. They are running good routes to get wide open. And when the ball is thrown their way, they catch it. Simple. Ball is the deep back as they line up in the eye. With the spin. And he's taken down at the nine-yard line. I think this offensive line is getting better and better as the game goes along. And coach, I'll tell you what, I think they're killing the will of this defense. And I don't think they're done just yet. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. the third touchdown on the ground today for the Heisman candidate. We don't even have to talk this guy up anymore. He does all his talking in the field. Yo, sweetheart, get the parade rolling in. Because I think the Heisman trophy is coming to town. They'll go for two in this situation. The Buckeyes line up in a goal line formation. They don't get the two. Ready to kick this one off. Garcia and Fry back deep to return. He just drills this one. Fry from his own end zone. Guys, what are you thinking at this point in the game? Well, time isn't on their side anymore. They need to get this ball down the field and get in the end zone. You're right, Coach. It's now a two-possession game. Not too much time to spare. They'll set up shot at the 26. Ohio State lines up in a dime defense here. 
Britain. On the option left side, he lateral. The ball's free. And the ball hawking safety scoops it out. How about that play, coach? Nice play from the key part of this defense. This safety is a big time football player. And that fumble recovery shows why. This is a great place to start the drive on the opponent's side of the 50. They come out with four wide out. He passes it. It's deflected. The defender had it and then dropped it. That's just a great defensive play. It won't look like much in the stat book, but that's getting the job done. So that'll make it second down. Second it's and second ten. and ten. Ball on the 31-yard line. Ohio State comes to the line with three wide. Hands it off. Clayton tackles him at the 29. The draw play gets maybe two yards. Third and 29 yard line. Third down. This defense is in the dime. Steps up in the pocket. And he's tackled at the 18-yard line. How about that pass, fellas? Well, Brad, the defense was coming with the blitz, and that opened some room for these guys to get open. Yeah, and if you're coming with the blitz, you better get to this quarterback. Otherwise, he'll make you pay. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone when performance matters most. The offense got six the last time they were inside the 20. Let's see what they do here. Looking, rolling out to the right side. Dumps it, and it falls incomplete. They came with a blitz that time and forced the overthrow by the quarterback. Good defense there. So it's second and ten. Ball of the 18-yard line. The Buckeyes are lining up with three receivers. He gets it. And down he goes at the nine. The delay gave the back some room to run, and he was able to pick up about nine yards. They'll line it up at the nine. Ohio State sets up in the eye. Johnson back to throw. Stepping up. Looking. Across the middle. Got it ball. A great play in the end zone by the cornerback. Man, oh man, this guy is some kind of athlete. He's a real playmaker out there on D. They'll line up for the field goal. And this is nothing more than a chip shot. The field goal attempt will be about a 26-yarder. It's up. And it sails through the upright. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Kicks it off. Fry fields it in the end zone. Three points was the result of their last drive as the offense heads out for another. Here's the offensive production statistics sponsored by Coca-Cola. The Buckeyes bring in the nickel package. Tackles him hard at the 23 with the carry. Seven yard game on the play. Second, Second down. Three. The Mountaineers go with the I formation. Fakes to the back. 
He throws it. He snags it. He's tackled at the 26-yard line. About three yards on the play fake. Third it's third down. Inches. Ball on the 26-yard line. The Mountaineers come out showing three wide. They'll give it off here. Henderson brings him down at the 31-yard line. And the run is good for the first. Yep, this is nothing new if you follow this team. They like to run the ball in these kind of situations. Terrific third down play call there. First and 10. Three wide outs here. Watson again. McKenzie with a takedown at the 32-yard line. So the delayed handoff gets maybe a yard. Second We've got and second nine. and nine here. Ball on the, the 32-yard line. The Mountaineers come out in a shotgun. Britton drops back, slips it short. Complete to the true freshman. And down he goes at the 34. So the defense kept everything in front of them on that play. They didn't pick up much on that play, but if they keep dumping it off like that, the safeties are going to have to creep up. When you force the safeties to play shallow, it opens up a whole other passing game. That's when you third hit them with the home run. On the so another third down run. upcoming for the offense. Britton with three wide receivers. He throws it and finds the true freshman. They picked up some yards, but it won't be enough to keep those chains moving. They went to the right guy. He just couldn't get away. It's one down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. Trick right. They bust up the play and stop them on fourth down. And that was a big stop defensively. Yeah, they only needed a few yards here to keep the drive alive. Great job by the defense to shut them down. They're going to flag the celebration there. First down. They'll take over and start this drive in midfield. The Buckeye with four receivers. Johnson back to pass. Johnson lets it fly. Got it to his receiver. And they make the stop at the 71. And Herbie, that was a good looking throw. Yeah, and what impresses me is the composure of this young quarterback. He made a great read, saw the open receiver, and delivered an almost perfect strike. Good looking play. First, it's first down. Ball on the 31 yard line. Ohio State goes with the ace set here. Johnson on first down. He flings it. His receiver has it. Touchdown, Ohio State. And he comes up with his second touchdown catch of the game right there. Kirk, this kid is tough to stop. Yeah, you're right, Coach. You try to keep tabs on him, but eventually he's going to find a way to get open. I think you need to double team him. And they line up for the point after. And he tacks on the extra point. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Fry from his own end zone. The offense heads out onto the field. In their last series, they opted to try and convert a fourth down, and they came up short. Right. 
The offense will take over the 20 yard line. The Mountaineer set up in the gun. Britton hands it off. He jukes, and he's tackled at the 29 yard line. That's a good nine yard gain. Second it's second down and one to go. Ball on the 29-yard line. The defense lines up with six DBs. Britton off the fake. He delivers, and they'll bring him down behind the line. Drop back a yard. They line up at the 28. Ball Third the down and two. Yard line. Four wide receivers in the formation. And he's level. What a hit. The D lineman wasn't letting anyone buy him that time. And the big fella did a heck of a job plugging up the hole when that play was supposed to go. That's so good, Kirk. He doesn't plug up holes. He plugs up the whole line down there. Yo. Four to the five. West Virginia ready to put this one away. Hall yeah. will be the return man. He gets it off. Hall takes it at the 33. They did a great job on their last drive, moving the ball down the field for a touchdown. Let's see if they can duplicate that on this drive. The Let's Ohio this drive Buckeyes at the 38. Take over Ohio the State comes to the line, only one First man in the backfield. Johnson fakes a handoff. Incomplete. Poor in pass, and his tight end couldn't reach it. Second, Second down and 10 to go. On the 38-yard line. Ohio State lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. Fires it quickly. Incomplete pass. The quarterback saw the blitz and just got rid of the ball. Receiver on the play. Third their own 38 yard line. It's third down. The Buckeye line up with three wide. Johnson drops to throw. Incomplete pass. Incomplete you can't pass. expect to get a good drive when you're unable to complete any passes. That's exactly why this one didn't get him any points. Fourth and ten. The Buckeyes All line up the front. Yard line. Pickings awaits the snap. Punts the ball away. Garcia fields it at the 26. There's a player injured down on the field. I can't see who it is. Oof, this would be a huge loss for this team. Let's hope this guy can get back into the game. The They'll take over, the the take over at the 28th. Take over at the 28-yard line. First and 10. Britain lines up with four wideouts. Surveys the field. Let's it fly. Batted ball. Heck of an effort by the defensive the back to knock that pass down. That's what the defensive back coach likes to see. His kids reacting when the ball is in the air and then making the play. Second, Second ten. down, 10 yards ball to go. On ball on the 28-yard line. line. One man backfield. Britain, little talk to the right. Yuku, and they'll bring him down behind the line. This is a heads-up play by the linebacker. He's playing run and had his eyes on the guy carrying the football from the get-go. Good defensive play. Third, Third and 12. 12. Ball West the Virginia comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. 
Looking to throw. He fires. Great coverage, and it's intercepted. The 10. Touchdown. What a great interception return by this defense. Hey, they say the best offense is a good defense. Yep, it sure is when they're putting points on the board. They'll line up for the extra point here. He makes the PAT. Takes it at the four. Guys, what do you think about this situation? Hopefully we'll see the offense move this ball up the field a little bit. Yeah, Coach, they really haven't had too much success today. But this is an opportunity for them to get their team back on track and build some confidence going into the next game. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coca-Cola. They line up with trips to the right. Britain with the give. Brought down at the 27. Watson picks up five with the carry. That'll bring up second down. Second, second down and five. five. Ball, Ball of their own 27. 27 Britton yard line. is back in the gun. Britton drops back to pass. This one is incomplete. Watson was the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it third down. Third it's and third five. and five. Ball, Ball on, on the 27-yard line. Britain with three wide receivers. And they got him for a loss. Number two two yard loss. Loss of two on the play. West Ball Virginia lining up the front. Stone is back deep to return the punt. He gets it away. Stone takes it to 36. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive. They almost went three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. They'll take over. They'll start this drive at midfield. First and Looks ten. like they've taken out their quarterback, and they're giving this young man some mop-up duty. With the game well in hand, they're going to get the other quarterback some playing time. Smart set to go to the air. Across the middle, hits his man in stride. To the 10. He's all the way home. Touchdown. Terrific pass, and the wideout hauls it in for the touchdown. Brad, the wide receiver's route was the key on that play. You're right, Kirk. His route running really has improved, and the quarterback has been throwing his weight a lot more. So the kicker's on the field to attempt the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. So with under five minutes to go here in the fourth, the score, Ohio State 71, West Virginia 35.
Ohio State gets set to kick this one away. And this one's away. Garcia fields it in the end zone. They've been getting walloped all day, but at least they're still working hard. I like a team that never quits. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers brought to you by Coke. Going with the shotgun here. And down he goes at the 38-yard line. down they line up in the shotgun wants to throw outside the ball is tipped but hold on we got a penalty on the play let's check it out holding on the offense 10 yard penalty Good call. Him. Yeah, he practically brought him to the ground there. First From their own 28-yard line. The 28 -yard First down. Line. The Mountaineers come out showing three wide. Flags are all over the place, and they'll blow it dead. Dead ball. Both start on the offense. Five yard penalty. Still that penalty will move them back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. First it's first in a mile. Ball on the 23 yard line. Britain steps back to pass. Let's it fly. And this one falls incomplete. Stevenson was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll make it second down. They line up at the 23. It's second and long. From the gun. Drops back to pass. Moves up in the pocket. His receiver has it. Good yardage that time on the pass. The thing that makes this play work is the quarterback. He throws this thing right in there. What an arm this quarterback's got. Third We've got third ball. along here. Ball on the ball 31 their own yard line. Britton lines up in the shotgun. And he's taken down at the 42-yard line. Nice run on that play, guys. Well, it's not enough for the first, Brad, but I think they got exactly what they wanted there. Fourth and six. The punter comes Ball on the field, the getting ready to send one off. Stone, the return man. He punts it. Stone fields it at the 19. The offense with a lot of success through the air on that last drive as they moved it down the field for the touchdown. They'll set up shot at the 26. Take over at the 26-yard line. First and 10. They're in the eye. Parks hits it on the inside. Jones brings him down for a loss. How about the play of this defense here? They got a great push up front, and they're able to wrap the fullback up for a nice stop. So line up at the 25. Ball on the second and 11 coming up. They'll bring him down at the 27. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. Third, Third down. down. The Ball Buckeyes the come to the line with their line. jumbo package. They line up in the jumbo set. 
The defense jumped, but I think a lineman moved first. Offsides on the defense. Five-yard penalty. Still well, the offense is helped down. out by that defensive penalty. You bet they are. That's an easy way to pick up yards. Third, Third down. Four. Ball on the 32-yard line. 391. And he's all the way down to the 35-yard line. So they pick up a huge run on third down. That last play was a brilliant call, Kirk. A good call, and you can see on that play that this offense is very well schooled. Everyone following their assignment. Well, I think they might have gone just a little too far that time. And sports for right time, only offense. 15 yard penalty, first down. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coca Cola. They come out in a goal line set. He gets another carry. Tackle made at the 48. A two-yard run by the halfback. There you have it, folks, your Coca-Cola players of the game. They really earned it out there today. Ohio State sets up in the eye. Down he goes at the 46-yard line. Two-yard carry by the fullback. Third the offense faces ball. another third down here as they line up. Schaefer lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Schaefer on the inside handoff. Payne brings him down at the 40-yard line. They call his number, and he carries for six yards. They'll call on the field goal unit. Four from 57 yards away. All on the 40-yard line. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. And this one finally comes to an end, and it wasn't even close. What are your final thoughts on the game, Coach? I can't say enough about this performance. Ohio State played an excellent game out there, dominating on both sides of the ball. They've got to feel pretty good after blowing out a team like this. Folks, that's going to do it for this edition of NCAA Football 2007. Again, our final score, Ohio State 71, West Virginia 35.